That's a very important issue, the issue of what do you do preoperatively if you've torn your ACL and what are we looking for before we, we actually do the surgery and you know, what can impact your outcome in the end. Um, I kind of lived through the days in the 80s and early 90s where everyone thought that we had to operate on ACLs right away. And we found that that le leads to, or can lead to a lot of stiffness in the knee in a process called arthrofibrosis, which is scar tissue in a joint. So there's, th there's very good data in the literature and very good clinical experience that essentially mirrors that, that you should wait and you should let things calm down. And so reducing swelling, regaining a normal gait pattern, getting all of your knee motion back where you can fully extend your knee, um, getting where you can fire your quad. So generally, I look for someone to get where they can kind of snap their knees back straight and fire their quad and walk with a normal gait pattern where you wouldn't really think they were limping at all. And once they can do that, then they're generally ready for surgery. A lot of times you get into the anxiety about, oh, I have to get back to sports sooner. You know, I mean, this is going to affect me on the tail end. And uh, my line for that is that you actually get better on the tail end sooner if on the front end you delay things a little bit. And so it doesn't, it's a little counterintuitive, but it doesn't really delay your ultimate return. Because if you have the surgery when your knee's biologically quiet, um, then the, the response of your knee to surgery is less and thereby you rehab better and you're ahead of the game so that in the end you get better quicker. You know, if you get real stiff and sore after surgery, it can be a long, tough sledding. You know, one other issue that comes up with um, preoperative management of ACL injuries is bracing. You know, should you or should you not? Do you need to be on crutches? Do you need to be in a brace? A lot of that depends on what else is injured. If you have another ligament injury, you might need crutches. You might need a brace to stabilize your knee. But if it's a routine isolated ACL tear, a lot of the braces that are given off the shelf actually inhibit knee motion and block your ability to straighten the knee. Most of the little simple double upright hinge sleeves that uh, are commonly given out, you know, for these patients actually are set to block the knee at 10 degrees of flexion. And one of the primary goals that you have is to restore full extension before you do surgery. So it doesn't, although it does help to have some compression on the knee, I would prefer just to use an elastic sleeve that doesn't restrict their motion at all, rather than blocking that extension. They do feel more comfortable if you block that extension, but you really need them to push through that a little bit and get it straight before they have surgery.